Hey, hello, hi, so back here. How you doing? Welcome back to the road to IC. We're gonna be doing Operation Regal Beast, which is the Alien Hunters DLC. We've got to go rescue Dr. Valen at her laboratory where the signal's originating from. We're taking it out. Maria, Isha, Bradford, Brittany, Susie, and Rudo. Let's get it on. Uh, this is Team Firework, by the way. Minus one soldier. Uh, Catalina has been benched for Bradford since he insists on leading this operation. So let's see what he's got. Maria will be second in command. I am continually monitoring the energy signatures we detected near the target site. Possible subterranean activity detected. Strong interference blanketing the area. Sensors are unable to penetrate the rock face. We still have a steady read on Valen's signal, however. I would advise extreme caution, Central. I advise extreme caution to the rest of you as well, not just Central. We've got a lot riding on this. We've got a, an ex XCOM doctor we need to rescue. Biological readings in this area are erratic. In addition to several species of alien. Hold on, Doctor. We've got something. The data must be preserved at all costs. You must hurry. Take this and find Bradford. It's her. Unfortunately, our friend never made it to the evac point. Nope, doesn't look I like he did. I meet my predecessor under less extreme circumstances. Still, I have tracked her signal to an area not far ahead. Good. Lead the way, Doctor. What are you talking about, Central? You're going to be leading the way. Doctor's not even here. You're the one who insisted on leading this operation. So, you'll be leading the way, Mr. Bradford. I expect you'll show these guys exactly what's up in terms of combat ability and leadership skills. Vipers. Oh. Whoa. Why do they have to be vipers? Though I share your reservations about this species, there's something different about these creatures. They appear almost underdeveloped. Perhaps an earlier stage of growth or some sort of precursor organism. Just as long as they're not bulletproof. Hopefully they're not bulletproof. That would be incredibly scary if they were. Uh, we've got like, our buddy system going on here. We've got Isha and Rudo working together. We've got Susie and uh, Brittany working together. And Bradford and Maria, the two leaders on the left side. Let's see what they can cook up for us. This is not good. The Vipers are sticking together. Go on, go. Okay. I think we're all right. I have managed to restore portions nice. of Dr. Valen's personal research logs. I will begin patching through what I can immediately. Oh. Testing. System detection. This is Dr. M. Valen. Initial entry. It has taken me longer than I have had to admit. The so that I can move on to more compelling work. Thank you. Uh, Isha, that was great work. I'm gonna try not to talk over Balan's uh, diary entries or logs or whatever. Yeah, Seem very interesting. Whoops. <laughs> That's all I have to say is whoops. Complete accident. Okay, 61%, not great. Where's Maria? Here we go. Do you wanna take a shot on these guys? Uh, 77. It's not bad. 77 as well. Before we get the one in the back, um, I'm gonna prioritize those eight health ones. Oh, damn it. Maria, I can't, you can't afford to miss these kind of shots. Uh, Bradford, do you wanna take a shot then? Alright, something. Six damage. Brittany can take one shot. Probably take one on this guy. Oh, guys! Well, I can't complain. It was a 59% shot. Alright, take a shot on this guy at the back. Gotta use her shadow ball already. Oh, well, you yeah, know, exactly that. It was a 100% guaranteed shot, so... Uh, that's something. Okay, 61%. Maybe uh, Isha can take a miraculous shot on the um, Viper closest to us. In the 
the meantime. Let's get Susie up slightly. 61%. Probably not going to kill it. Prove me wrong. Um, he dodges. That's alright. We'll just see what happens. Stay cool. Of course, we're poisoned already. Bruto. Whoa. Looks like the aliens are having a bad day as well. Isha, no shot. Oh, there we go. Nice. Good work. Shiz. Okay, we already got... Okay, I'm not too worried about Bradford, but Maria's injured. That's annoying. While attempting to salvage materials from what appeared to be a totally inert storage system, I made an astonishing discovery. A single cryostasis unit remained intact and occupied. This changes everything. I'm sure I like the sound of that. Neither. Neither. Alright, Bruto's just gonna slice that other viper open. We'll get uh, Isha. Maybe slice this one. Go for it. The blade buddies. Love these two working together. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's move Maria out of the poisonous cloud. Get a heal on her. I'm not too worried about Bradford. He's got a lot of health. And it doesn't matter that he's injured. I mean, um, like, he's not coming out on another mission. So that's fine, but I don't want Maria to start getting gravely wounded or anything. Did she? I thought she. Okay. I think Maria gets three turns now. It seems. Because, yeah. Okay. Is this some sort of perk? Does she have an endurance runner or something? I know that's something that uh, these guys can get. Combat rush, like swimmer. Oh, okay. Okay, I don't know what's going on there, but uh, that's pretty handy, I guess. Let's just overwatch you guys, Bradford. You move up. Don't poison anyone else, please. I need to save that medkit just in case something else goes catastrophically wrong. Oh, Bradford's still poisoned. It's it annoying. appears to be the remnants of an alien genetics facility. With the damage to these containment units being so severe. I can only imagine the work that was being done here. Was she living out here? Just what the hell were you up to, Mama? Alright, let's just take a moment to sort okay, ourselves really. out. Not let's a move problem. up slightly. Uh, can we get closer to your team, Rudo, please? Now you're a lone wolf type. We'll just overwatch everyone else and reload those who need it. Bradford's still poisoned. Come on. Let's just wait until he was. Oh, it's fine. I now have a rare opportunity, one never afforded to me during my time with XCOM. I am free to pursue a research directive of my own choosing. That's pretty handy. Bradford, come on, get over it already. By the time we're done, we're gonna hear all of our logs. Alright, Isha landing a beautiful shot there. Rudo helping her out. Maria landing a shot. And Susie landing a shot. That's great work, team. Susie gets a promotion out of it. Fantastic. I think Bradford's finally over it. Thank you. Still one more. Given these creatures' apparent pliability when it comes to drastic changes in their genetics, I believe it may be possible to reverse selected traits that the aliens themselves engineered into dormancy. Okay, Rudo, catch up to your friend. Oh, yeah. 
ally. I don't know, you don't like having friends. Bradford, move up. Brittany, move up. You're concealed, so you can't exactly overwatch. That's pretty annoying. This one move. Yeah, see, she's got three moves. It's pretty cool. I like it. Good job, Maria. Very good perk choice, even though it was completely random. Everyone else just overwatch, see what we got going on. I have rerouted the outgoing signal. The unit must have been damaged during whatever conflict occurred here. The complete message is coming through now. An extreme biological hazard is present throughout this area. Genetically enhanced alien species in this region are of particular concern to the civilian populace. Do not approach under any circumstances. All attempts should be made to avoid contact with these life forms. This isn't a message. It's a warning. You got it, Bradford. Wonderful detective skills. Got going there. No wonder you are my right-hand man. Okay, let's just overwatch everyone really quickly. What do we got? Anything? Okay, bro. Uh, Valen seems to be getting slowly more and more obsessed with her work. And we all know what happens with mad scientists and getting obsessed with their work. Let's advance slowly again. Oh, got action somewhere. Multiple biological signatures approaching your position. Readings are erratic. Difficult to pinpoint. Unable to determine at this point. That doesn't sound very good. We got lots of vipers incoming. Oh no, Bradford only got one. Overwatch out. Everyone else, what are you doing? Come on. Isha just freaking landing every Let's shot. Go. Let's go. Heads up, people. Is that it? Looks like it's it for now. Where is it? Well, I find this very intriguing. Got three vipers and I think two of the weak ones next to them. Overwatch. Thankfully, Brittany's concealed. Let's maybe slow down a bit here. Let them come to us. Let's reload. Good to go. Again. Let's do this. Ready. Nice. Alright. Good call, Chief. Scanning. We'll see what's going on. Yep, more vipers slithering out of these little holes. And no overwatch is being landed. God damn it, guys. He shot again. My goodness. Misses no days off. Or miss, I think. I don't think she's uh, got someone. Oh, one. There we go. Good shot, Maria. Well done. Whoa. Coming out from the roof now. Rudo, not to be outdone. Doesn't miss with the stock. I believe this may be the last of them, Central. I am not detecting any additional signatures. Understood. Whoa. That's a lot. That's a huge pod. I'm so glad the, the pod sizes aren't this big. Oh, Isha. Oh, she lands the shot. Not bad. More. Oh my goodness. I am so glad we didn't move up. That is a lot of red. Alpha and Beta both continue to exhibit exaggerated, sometimes erratic variations on their traditionally observed behaviors. Subject Gamma has grown to become something else. Behind those eyes, there is an intelligence that I have not witnessed in any unaltered specimens of its kind. I'm going to go up for these uh, higher health vipers because I have a plan. 
wants to get rid of most of these guys. Hopefully she lands the shot. No, of course not. It's still moving. It is, it is. Okay, that's fine. My plan involves Bradford getting a bit crazy with the blade. We're gonna use Reaper. And let's get his hands dirty. I don't know how many you'll be able to kill. Hopefully we can kill as much as we can. Let's see. Maybe we go deep into enemy territory. Or do we just kill the ones that are nearby? Let's just kill these nearby ones, I guess. Kill the one right beside you. Nice. This one. We need to be careful because every slash we do, the damage gets reduced. So let's end it on a high note. Uh, three to five. Yep, go for this one. And if he doesn't get a kill, the Reaper stops. Two to four. I want to take him somewhere nice. Uh, can he not reach that other one? That's annoying. Okay, let's go for this one. Nice. And we've got a flanking shot on the Viper here. Let's see if uh, we can get any more kills first. Uh, Susie can take a 77% shot here. Ah! One damage. Bradford. Can you kill that one? It's too far away. It's too far away. Damn, that one useful because he can only do one of three. Okay, never mind. Just, um, see if you can crit this guy. Oh, of course you can. You're Central Officer John Bradford. And he gets a free action. Of course he does. Because he's John Bradford. Okay, let's take a risk. Can you kill this Viper? Can. Awesome. Alright. Five to seven. Where's this one? 93. Could crit him. Maybe we just guarantee a kill with this one. Nice. Oh, we're out of reactions, unfortunately. That's okay. Okay, let's get Maria up. She's got three moves now, which we can confirm now by seeing those arrows. Let's reload. And let's take a shot. Oh, the Viper, 80%. Come on, make it a good one. Oh, yes. That's what I'm looking for. Cool. Oh, we've got a couple left. We've got one, two, three. Don't know if there's any others. And I don't want to use the axe just yet. Because. Well, who do we have left? We've got Rudo and Isha left. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Alright, Isha, do you want to go kill this one? Hopefully, close combat specialist the other one. Maybe we'll get Rudo to try and kill that other one in the distance. Nice. Okay, never mind, we can't even flesh that guy. Can you see him from here? Okay. Yeah, I knew it. You've got the advanced stock. This should kill him no matter what. Doesn't matter, you land the shot because you're awesome. Nice you're Rudo. Okay, you shit's on you. Make it a good one. Just does not miss. Got it. You did. You wonderful assault, you. Central, I am picking up faint traces of human DNA deeper in the facility. It just might be. Uh oh, it's not a good sign. Alrighty, should you want to pick up the All loot? Right. We've got two Illyrium cores. Good enough. You know what I just realized? Again, we forgot to freaking equip someone with the warsuit. 
I need to equip that as soon as I get back to base now, because I just keep forgetting. Like, it's hard, like, when you come back to the game and you start the next mission straight away, you're just, like, not even thinking about armor. You're thinking about the weapons and the uh, utility of the armor itself. Sure. Need to work on that. Anyway, there's no more enemies, so let's just make a break for it. Um, for the objective. Because we need to rescue Valen. Yeah. From what we've heard, it's not a good sign. Okay. Central, reading a massive drop in temperature directly ahead. Such a large discrepancy defies any natural explanation. Something tells me that won't be the worst of our problems, Doctor. Right. Bradford has a gut feeling. We all know what happens when he gets those gut feelings. I don't know what, he, what happens when he gets those gut feelings. I didn't even know he could feel that. The Elder's temple is a genetic fabric of their subordinate races. Knows no bounds. It occurs to me that this is the first male of the species I have ever encountered. Is this a form of population control? Or something more? Am I looking at the fate of my own species? Alright everyone, help it. Don't question me. Just line up on this ridge and look at that strange body I'm reloading. ahead and get ready because as Tiger has said this is an unnatural event having frost and stuff in this cave so let's uh, be wary of what could happen. Get ready. I want you guys to all to overwatch. You sure you're going to lead the way? Go check the body. Unable to tell from this distance. Uh, Life signs uh, are being obscured by. Here he is! The Viper King himself! He's not a happy camper. I believe this would be Subject Gamma. Fallen created a Viper King. Just what we needed. Yep. Come on, Isha, make it a good one. Close combat specialist. Everyone else? Land some shots. Oh, Isha, you kind of put a mist right now. Oh, he's on fire. We're landing some good shots. Nice. Oh, Rudo missing as well. And we've got enemies coming out of the rocks as well. Oh, the Viper King stunned. According to the notification on the bottom right, I will take it. Uh, let's throw the axe at him. Free shot. Two damage. Oh, the armor. Freaking out. Uh, Isha, do you want to take a shot here? Uh, yeah, we're better off taking a shot. Go for it. Make it a good one. Whoa! I don't know how much damage that was. But it looks good. Uh oh, we've got a lot of more vipers coming out. Everyone's in the open. Let's see what these guys can do. Bradford, stay cool. One damage. That tickled, didn't it? Hopefully he takes all the damage. Not, nothing against you, Bradford, but uh, doesn't matter if you get wounded, let's be honest. I'm going 
going to acid it instead of frosting it. The damage over time should help. And we'll get rid of the armor. Surely he'll be dead by the end of this. Oh, whoa. Six damage on burning. Isha, do you want to finish him off? Or should I get someone else to? You're down on the ground. I'd rather probably just get you killed with something over there. Who, want, who should I give this kill to? Susan's already promoted. Rudo. Bradford. Let's give it to Brittany. He's all yours. Nice one. 17 damage. And we get combat rush. Take out this one as well if you can. Good work. That's how it's done. You should you want to go kill one of these? Nice. Woo, keep that up and we are out of here. Rudo, do you want to kill the other one? Your blade buddy. Oh, beautiful. Sorry, interrupt whatever you're doing. It's over. Nice piece of cake. Oh, jeez. Not her. Are you sure? We kind of melted it away. Central, I am not detecting any additional life signs, human or otherwise. The cavern is clear. All right, the first alien ruler is down. Two to go. Amazing work from the firework squad. Well done. Central is overqualified. Well, yeah. He did some freaking mean moves with the blade. I could just imagine Rudo looking at him going, Whoa. That's... That was alright. Six out of ten job, Bradford. But, uh, yeah, no, that was awesome. Too old for this shit. Maria got poisoned. Sadly, at the beginning. Hopefully she's not out for too long. Cool. We may have opened Pandora's box now. Now we've got the other two roaming around out there somewhere. Something tells me we're going to run into them really quickly as well. Let's just hope our team is equipped to deal with them. Whew. Seven days. It's a shame, but uh, what are we going to do? Bradford injured for 12. Not that he's coming out with us. 10 kills in one mission. Amazing. Isha, doing some incredible work down there. What do we got? Hit and run. Rapid fire. Oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Rapid fire is good, but her aim is not. And, um, what else? Hit and run's good. Like, we get an additional move if we take a flank, a shot against a flanked target. Um,. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. I might have to wait on this. I'll decide later on. Let's uh, promote Susie. I know what we're going to give her. Do I? <laughs> Let's give her a revival. For now. We've got the rulers. And then uh, we'll change it later. She's a misogynist. Against. Yeah, okay. Got a lot of gender issues, don't we? I think I've mentioned that already. Having successfully recovered one of Dr. Ballin's genetically modified test subjects, I am eager to begin conducting an autopsy as soon as possible. It is my hope that by following her own research notes, I will gain an even greater understanding of just how she managed to accomplish these rapid changes. I don't even know if we can understand how she managed those rapid changes. Okay, looks like we got three engineers just, like, sitting around on their ass doing nothing. Let's remedy that right away. Oscar, Mech, Edgardo, what are you doing? Come on, I need this cleared out yesterday. Please. Walters, focus fire training. And, uh, I think Isha is the one waiting for a promotion. Yep. Don't worry, Isha. I'll get to you. I'll never forget to promote someone as cool as you are. Okay. 
Uh, what were we doing? We needed to make contact, which we've done. We need to sort of snake our way up to this facility thanks to this ridiculous layout of resistance forces. <laughs> like, across the world. Like, there's literally, like, some sort of wall here that's blocking our communication with Africa. We have to take the long way. Uh, let's go for the alloys, I guess, since we've got nothing else to do. We could build a... Oh, no, we can't build a town. We don't have the supplies. Avenger plotting new course. Furies. 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 Let's grab the alloys. Produce more weapon attachments for its troops, allowing them to use a, a random advanced upgrade. I've never seen this before. That's so cool. Not really. Walter, finished. With the leadership training, that's cool. I could put him in for more, but I think I'm going to swap him out for Maria. We'll take Walter's squad out next time. See what they're capable of. Give uh, Team Firework a rest. Anton. Got Soulfire now. Insanity. That'd be cool. Please keep it up. And I'm still... You're still under investigation for that dark VIP mission we did. We have three dark events active. How freaking aggressive is that by advent? Priority message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander. And you have outdone yourself. Well, I thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, let's uh, reveal this hidden event where we got alloy padding. That's kind of annoying. Nothing too crazy. Um, is Maria out of the advanced warfare yet? I don't think so. Maybe we just uh, chuck someone in here really quickly. Oh, look at that. Did you see that? Walter. Oh, he's gone now. But Walter was with Maria just then. Like, leader talking to leader. What are you guys up to? Nice little chat going on. Rudo sitting by himself, as usual. Nice. Good. Everyone's behaving. I like it. Very, very good. Yep, Maria's done. I think I could have predicted this outcome. Though it is intriguing. Looks like the research was done at the same time. The currently idle. We're wasting valuable time and resources by not conducting any research. Please consider providing us with a directive as soon as possible. Central right, claims to have relax. seen one of these things up close back in the day. Despite a lot of Although it had been years since I conducted my last autopsy, I heard the process return to me quite naturally. This subject was perhaps less intimidating because of its similarities to varying reptile species found naturally on Earth. Because of extensive cytogenetic modifications to the subject's chromosomes, this could very well be the only male variant in the entire species. Interesting. The only male variant. Thank you, Tygen. Working within the tight constraints of the Avenger, I've had a difficult time finding room to conduct some of our more theoretical experiments. Perhaps the next time we set down. No. Behave yourself, Tygen. No crazy experiments. 20 available. Is that right? Wow. I didn't realize we had so many soldiers. It's a bit crazy. Let's probably go for the supplies Avenger instead of the alloys. Completely forgot that they were there. Quick. As much as you can before the next mission comes. Okay. Incoming transmission. Extract the VIP Operation Flying Terror. We're going to get an engineer out of it. Course for sector one, nice. The Arctic. Hamish Langdon. Interesting. Can't wait. Alright. Let's clear the squad. Who are we taking out? We're taking out Walter's team, aren't we? Um, let's take out Kylie. She hasn't come out yet. I'm very interested to see her skills. Uh, let's take... It's an extract of VIP. Very difficult. So we're taking a squaddy, which is pretty dangerous. So let's get uh, our colonels on the job. We haven't taken Zahara and Catalina out for a while. Let's get uh, Walter out. Let's get Darius out. And maybe this time we take out our Psy operative, Anton. 
Or should we take out Emily? Or our other shinobi? Uh, well, you could use a stealth class. So maybe we'll take out Emily. We'll take out a cyber sometime next. Sometime soon, I should say. Oh, and we might have a freaking... Uh, whew, a Berserker Queen out there roaming around. So we better be careful for that. I will give someone the war suit next time. I'll cut these guys out all next time. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me, guys. I'm glad that we're still hanging in there for the road to IC. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next episode. I'm so glad that uh, you guys are also commenting, by the way, with these stories. If you haven't read them, just like give them a quick read. They're just so amazing and like give some life to these characters. Anyway, take care, everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye!